do 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 do. What's up, y'all? Any of you guys, uh, gamers? Anybody playing uh, Portal games? Portal is one of the best puzzle games of all time. If you like shooters, if you like puzzles, you will like what this song is from. There's no lyrics in it right now, but if you like Daft Punk, you will like this song. Um, with the, especially with the the vocoder singer on it. Anyway, I have the absolutely gorgeous Mars Wackadoo with me. Say hello to the people. Hello. Hi. Hi. What's up, y'all? Hello, everyone. So, <laughs> got a lot of people in the chat, like, preemptively. I appreciate the crap out of y'all. Anthony, we got freaking Dustin, Rob, Sean. Can't even scroll. Please let me scroll, please. Jason Coverstone, what's up? I'm coming undone. <laughs> coming undone. Lander asks, uh, oh, and of course Lander. Lander's always holding it down all the time. Uh, I got a special shout out for Lander here in a second, but let me read this. Spooks, when are you going to do the hideout intros and outros again? Like when you pop out from under the screen. Don't worry, buddy. When I come back to, to videos for real, I'll... I'll be sure to, re to reinstall that. Path Dunk? I love Path Dunk. Jason. What's up, Jasmine? Hey, hey Spook and Mars. Hello, uh -huh. hello. I love that, Spook and Mars. Um, anyway, back to my man Lander. Was uh, shouting me out to the man Arlo himself. And he came by and commented on the stream. And uh, so I just got to say a massive thank you to Lander for that. He also gave me some uh, Discord, like, teaching today. Essentially, he helped me uh, figure out how to use the Drug Receipts Discord that I, I'm not kidding you. I have been a part of for probably four or five months now. <laughs> and I, like, I sure, I probably could have put more time into it. That's just me being lazy. But Lander helped me figure it out in, like, one minute how to actually be a part of that. So, thank you. And then immediately after that, Arlo Eisenberg was messaging me in the public chat on that on Discord talking about uh, you know the destroy all girls thing and how he's covered it extensively and he says that my reaction is uh, justified essentially so <laughs> Susan Mott book parental units are present <laughs> they're parental <laughs> units that's how that's their designation. <laughs> Mom, uh, I want to have you on to react to the guy that I'm talking about, Arlo Eisenberg. I'm going to queue up his videos when you come on, and uh, we'll get your reaction as a mother who still sees me as a child. <laughs> <laughs> because people want to know what parents think of their children getting into rollerblading, and I think that's an niche area that we can uh, we can fill on my channel. So. Anyway, um... Let's just watch some stuff. Ben just put out a video uh, where he robs a bank on rollerblades. You see his thumbnail? He goes to jail. You guys know that Ben is in jail? You know that Ben's in jail? No. Ben texts her a lot. I'm just kidding. I said to shut that down. <laughs> I, I'm more than one song. <laughs> oh, man. Did... Uh, Honest question. Did you sing another song? I did go to end up going to bed relatively early. People were uh, doing karaoke long into the night at uh, RNC. Um, did you do another song? Because I would absolutely love to hear you cover another song. Dustin, what's the agenda this evening? I don't know. You tell me. What do you want to do, brother? <laughs> it's like you want to draw. You want to watch some videos, suggest something. I don't know. You do, you do you. I'll do me. And we'll vibe together. Let's do it, homie. SoundCloud question from last... Oh, sweet. Awesome. I'm glad you figured it out. Um, Back to Blading is going live at 9, so we're going to end it at 9 on the dot. Go over to that. This is a special one. If you guys are going to go, you have to go to Gear Talk episode 117, and you have to use a Halo reference when you go. This is incredibly important. I'm calling all gamers. Calling all gamers. Master Chief Spartan 117 is being requested for duty at Gear Talk episode 117, Big Wheels. What would Master Chief ride? Do you think he would ride anti-rock or 60 mil with 55 mil flat now, people? No, of course not. He's going to ride 
the Werbe the Werbeskis. All right. So anyway, you're gonna drop in like an ODST. <laughs> you're gonna say, "Reporting for duty, Master Chief, Part One One Seven." I'm gonna go start that right now. I'm doing it. It's live in 73 minutes. <laughs> Oh, uh, a little tip for you. You can do this in all apps, by the way. It's like a, usually a little, like three lines and they have little squares on them that look like uh, soundboard mixer dials. Um, that's on the app. Switch to live chat. You'd be surprised how many messages YouTube doesn't push through because it's like, eh, it's not cool yet for me. How is no one like this yet? Pre-show. Interesting. Oh, is this maybe so he can cue it? Uh, or section it up later. <laughs> Dustin, I'm driving. You keep me company. Okay, um, hold on. We gotta sing Why Georgia. Get over here. <laughs> Dustin, you better be singing Why Georgia. I'm thinking of, uh, I can never think of lyrics on the spot. That's my issue with karaoke. I want to do it, but I, I freeze. I can't do it. And I, I can't tell you, I, honestly, Why Georgia by John Mayer is probably the most, it's one of the songs I've listened to the most. I am driving 85 in kind of morning, let's all have to I, I hope you were expecting that. You should have been. Uh, alive and well, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sean. Yeah, so, um, Sean, I was bo uh, born in Hisdale in... Uh, in from ages born to three was in Bolingbrook, which is where Dustin's at. Um, so I don't know if that gives any frame of reference of how much of a Chicagoland child I am, but that's that gives that's about the extent of it. <laughs> anyway, this is not a video. This is just a thing. So I'm going to steal Ben's views. Give me your content, Ben. <laughs> what a thing to uh, see right away <laughs> oh man i love mike mcfly and ben together they're so like is it it's is it weird that ben feels like a honestly he already feels like a dad like he already seems he's got dad vibes it's so funny him jorts. and mike especially together <laughs> and no i didn't say daddy vibes if you quote me that if you hey if you say that to ben I'm banning you. <laughs> Line on blades. Man, I want to get out and skate with Mike, too. His skating, like, I mean, it's in as much respect as I can. Like, I'm surprised by the things that he does. Him and Wyoko, they both remind me in the same way that they have, like, the same angle of attack every single time they're coming at a trick. And then when they do it, it can be completely different, and you would never know because it's only different at the very last second. It's like they come in and it's like, I'm going to do a back stab or I'm going to do a top acid or I'm going to do like a, a true pawn, you know, and it's like, I mean, I'm, I'm not referencing any trick that I've actually seen, but just generally fun to watch them. That, and did you guys catch, I don't know if you were watching any of the stuff that Mike and Ben were streaming together, um, but uh, someone asked, I think, how much money there was in Mike's uh, collectible room. And hey, speak of him, uh, speak of the greatest skater ever, and he will show up. We are just talking about you, Wyoko. Um, talking about your skate style. Um, anyway, what was I? I was talking about Ben or something. <laughs> the room and how much? That's is... right. How much does that cost? Uh, he said it was like 300 or close to 325,000 or something like that of collectibles in that room, which is just amazing. <laughs> I love that. Hey, what are you doing? Just knocking over my keyboard. Anyway, uh, I'm sure you guys all know Wayoko. What did you say? Not even close to what? I take, I consider you all my friends, and I don't like when people insult my friends, so you better not be insulting my friend. <laughs> Value of Mike's collection? Not even close? Oh. <laughs> That's hey man, that's what he said. That's from his mouth, man. He said that on his stream. If that's what you're talking about, that's what he said. Maybe he's joking. I took him too seriously. 
Apple. I'm a diva. You're blocking my light. <laughs> Apple news. Being the best kid. Okay, good. I was gonna say, it's like, it's like I'm pretty sure I'm right about <laughs> Mike, but. Oh, okay. Uh, duh. Yeah. You are the best skater, though. I mean, Brian Aragon doesn't follow me. Does he follow you, Mr. Wyoko Booter? The prince of skating? <laughs> Sean, that shirt alone is going to be worth half a million when Nike sues me. <laughs> hey, well. You just point the f <laughs> no, I was going to say you point the finger at gods. And I, I mean, I guess I said it anyway. <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> don't do that <laughs> but I didn't do anything look at this instead <laughs> 8 rollerblading can I do poles community moderation uh no wait huh. no that's not what I'm looking for a nice try though <laughs> Uh, poles. Uh, how do you do? Ben. Everybody say Ben. Everybody type Ben. Maybe it'll show up. <laughs> Why Yoko? He only follows me because I'm local. <laughs> yeah, well. Yeah. Does he follow me? That's so. <laughs> nah, dude. But I really love your skating. I love watching your videos. Sure, that's why he follows you, homie. Have confidence, bro. That's pretty cool, though. I want to get out there. Yeah, Wyoko, the fakie shirt is rad, isn't it? Yeah, Sean's got great ideas. The shirts are nice. Good Sesh is probably one of my favorite, like, rollerblading icons, honestly. Because, like, there's not enough, in my opinion, shirts and stuff that, A, have actual rollerblades on them but are referencing skating in general uh, and i think that's a good job there <laughs> the way he tumbles and then he's like amazed that he kind of like, wow oh. look at that guys ah. i love that they had a whole driveway session it's awesome and what are you saying i can't hear you speak up not, not a chill bill streak. i mean he, why, who why am i worried he doesn't have copyright music <laughs> Oh. All right, so I'm going to, as a, like, a little bit of a stair step. What's up, Libby? Hey. I'm basically just going to jump on. Apple. Apple, what the hell? Cat's knocking things. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? You look up. rabid. And then start no. feeling out <laughs> what the TTP might look like. Hey, Sean, it's coming. It's coming. Hey, man, yeah. Pink for sure. We like, we like the pink. Uh, and also, I don't know if you're a fan of uh, Heather colors, but if you did solid colors, I, I like solid colors more than Heather. <laughs> I know you. I want the uh, your millhouse stuff. Don't worry, I get paid soon. Job <laughs> with the money sign. M -m 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 money. Ah, b -b 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 money. <laughs> Should we all make videos and post at the exact same time without telling Ben, just making fun of him, just like we all dress up in something similar to one of his most popular videos or something, and or we just all get in front of a camera and pretend we're streaming, and just 10 videos post at the exact same time with, like, <laughs> absolutely no word beforehand, and he gets them all. Oh boy, we got hissing. What's going on here? Oh, it's his videos. Oops. I thought there was hissing <laughs> in my audio. <laughs> I'm very sorry about when I reenact your amazing performance of John Mayer in a reel. <laughs> Don't be sorry. Play that on repeat. What was that? Did he just meme on us? <laughs> Satisfaction. <laughs> He's gonna get struck for that. Copyright us. Uh, struck. Ugh. 
I held my skates in my hands for the first time since I fractured my ankle. Uh, what was it, two days ago or whatever, or this weekend? I was just like, they still smell new. It makes me angry. That's what makes me the most angry. <laughs> that, and I keep forgetting, I have footage of when I got the fracture, but I roll off camera, and then maybe a foot later, my foot gets caught. And so you don't see anything happen. I'm, I'm quite sure, quite certain, quite certain, but uh, I have to look. Also, when it was broken, I didn't want to do it. Oh, that's right. Uh, Rob, you set up here. I think I saw you say uh, you added for the community edit. Yes, here we go. Uh, further up earlier, I uploaded to the July folder spook two whole clips now. Dude, thank you so much. I appreciate that. But you are sitting on clips. Honestly, at this point, I don't care when they were shot because uh, I don't... Yeah, I'm busy this weekend. I gotta, I'm got in a wedding this weekend. I just don't think I'm going to be able to shoot... I mean, I don't know when I'll be able to edit either, but I did just want to shoot a funny little bit where I, like, roll around on my scooter in a parking lot and submit, like, a 10-second video just so there's a little more variety to it. Did he just do it at Torque Christ? What was that? Are you... It's like, I know that we're all in agreement here, but seriously, we do need to talk about more the fact that, like, when is a product with Ben's name going to come out on, like... With his name on it, gonna come out. Yeah. Dude is crazy good. Yeah. <laughs> like, come on. When he gets that RV, so, man, he needs to just like film street edit after street edit, make uh, videographer friends in every city he goes to, and uh, just let them do the edit because you know me, I would do that for him and I'd hand it to him. He doesn't, I don't have to put it on my channel, he can have it. I'll just have, you know, slip my logo in there, but look at that. There it is. Goodness gracious, boy. What you doing out there in Tallahassee? Getting Tallah nasty. So he's really trying to go backwards on that Unity, bro. What's wrong with you? He did a good job there, too. Can we get to cutting your leg off already? I got to get with him back to bleeding an hour. <laughs> That's the best comment I've ever received. Yeah, yeah, we're getting to it. We just gotta get the bone drill. Gotta find my trusty high torque Milwaukee so I can get those UFS bolts right in there on the bone. Then I'll be known as the stump skater. Now blade with one long stroke and one long stump to hold, you know, just one long kick. Right, like I'm surfing. Optic times, what is that? <laughs> Hey, see your roller booters. Hey, look at that. There I am. I love ragging on Ben. Uh, I feel like I have to clarify because I do it so much that I do love the man. I love what he's doing. <laughs> it took him like four months to put my name on the Patreon thing. Yeah, it's probably closer to two. Who am I kidding? But I was real salty. I, was, I just wanted to see how long it was going to take. I think it took about two months. <laughs> Like, why am I giving you money if my name ain't up there? That's the whole reason. <laughs> the only reason. Oh, man. I, I cannot wait till the RV thing comes. I, I really, like, he's he's definitely saying that that's what he's going to do. So, uh, man, that's going to be so fun for all of us. <laughs> Enough chit-chat and more hacking. I need a saw, bro. Anybody got a Senate-branded bone saw? We got, uh, Are We Skating here? 172 subscribers, 9 views, and 2 likes. Come on, everybody needs to immediately watch this. When this comes out, 172. Bam! <laughs> I like these, like, hexagon facades there. Look at this dude go. What is, what is that, man? What's, come on. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Gee, bitch. I did this morning. Richard, welcome by the way. I can't get this freaking chat to scroll, please. Anybody play uh, Wii games, billiards? Do you ever have Wii games? Mm -hmm. Yeah, did you remember this song at all? Yeah. 
Yeah. They do. Caleb and I would fall asleep to this song playing this and the fishing one, which I'm going to have a video soon. I'm just doing a compilation video. Actually, I would love to get opinions on this. And again, I wish I could do a poll. Maybe. A, you know. Oh, I can't. I figured it out. Beautiful. <laughs> it was that easy. Here we go. I will tell I, I will poll you right now. What's a good length for a channel? Okay, hold on. Let me start again. What's a good length for a progression clip show? For somebody who's taking clips from their existing media. So stuff you've... If you've witnessed... Uh, witnessed if you've watched my videos, you've seen before. Uh, what's a good length for a progression clip show? So let me put that up there. What's a good length for a progression clip show? And so what I mean by that... Yes or no? Well, can I change? Okay, yes, I can. Um, what I mean by that is, like, how long... And be real with me. Don't think of, like, oh, it's spook wackadoo. Think of, like, if you stumbled across this video on YouTube, you know? Like, think that you didn't know me. How long would you watch a, a clip show of somebody showing off their bad skating going to whatever they're skating at now? And, yeah, I'm taking a long time to get this poll up. Sorry. <laughs> Five... Minutos. Ten minutes. Add option fifteen. Menudo. 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 You guys ever eat menudo? You guys like menudo? Just uh, tell the people about menudo. Tell me. Tell me if you like it. I don't like menudo. If you like it, you are in my well, book as a good person. I mean, yeah, I, I, that's true, but give them some context if they don't know. What if they don't know yet? Hey, Xander's yeah. here. What's up, Xander? Sorry, like I wasn't a, at the bottom a of the beef channel. tripe soup, um, Mexican soup. Sorry, guys, I'm taking forever with this uh, poll. It's up there now. Sorry if you thought the poll was up. It wasn't. <laughs> Uh, hey, Anton! Hey, I was just talking about you, um, and Sean, and actually, like, well, I, I'll reach out to the pertinent people, but Anton and Sean, I've talked to you guys about this already a little bit on the stream before, but I would love to have both of you on at some point, um, individually, and then, hell, even together would be fun, but, uh, I still am figuring out the best way to do streaming, um, I could guess a good way to ask you now if you're both present is if you know how to use Discord. <laughs> if you know how to use Discord, I feel like that could be the best way for me to do it. Anyway, love to have you two on. I got lots of questions about just like your past with skating and then what's going on with what, uh, you know, what you want to talk about with your companies because I'm all interest, man. Let this dude go. Like, he's putting in the work for this. This is Are We Skating, by the way. But, uh, what up? Just crawled out of bed in time to catch the live stream. I didn't even... I need to be, get better about reading these comments when I highlight them. Bro, this is not worth losing sleep. I mean, because you can go to sleep for another 56 minutes before Back to Blading is live streaming. And, you know, we're all gonna bug them standard. <laughs> I... I gotta be real with you. I'm, like, I've been told with the people that I've been told by, the pertinent people... That I have, so, I, like, my guesses for the standard team, well, Yandi is the obvious one. Like, we can just get Yandi out of the way. Yandi, it's Yandi. We, like, that's no confirmation for me, but we know it's Yandi. But I'm confirmed on another person uh, so strongly that I've been told actually not to talk about it. So I think I, I, I like, that pretty much confirms that I know who it is. Uh, so I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be really upset if I was just told not to talk about because you're, like, messing with me. But you never know. This is a beautiful ledge. Okay, um, Mariah, what uh, what skates do you want? We've talked about skates a lot. You like the black thems, you like Mesmer, but would you want those Mesmer skates, like black ones? I know you want black skates. <laughs> she just just I don't know if you guys can hear my dog whining, whining. but she's just sitting she's here insane. wanting attention. I am doing awful with the chat. I saw Lander, he said, Menudo is not for the weak. <laughs> you are right, Lander. It is not. What are you saying? 
don't like Mountain Dew though. But no, Lender, I'm Delicious. glad that you do. I love. Here's the thing. I love Omni. I love the broth. Um, I just don't like the stomach lining. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like that meat. I don't like okay. tripe. <laughs> you know, it's it's delicious. Uh, Rob, <laughs> my wife used to be a fan oh. of Menudo. <laughs> oh, of Menudo the group. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're not talking about a band. Sorry. I don't know. I, I don't know anything about the band, honestly. But the food? I love the food. I grew up on eating Menudo, so... Oh well, yeah. That's I mean, they that's, always that's a home, huge really. part why yeah, it's a I love it. Big so much. part of yeah. the happy. <laughs> no. Why are you whining over here like the grudge? Um, Wyoko, yeah, no, for sure. The algorithm definitely favors the things that people search, and with blading, it seems that the most searched things are like, well, I want to buy a skate let me look up reviews of that or i want to buy a wheel or this and that not many people are that interested in watching things like that like progression or i'm learning new tricks i've, I've seen the same thing but just know that i i enjoyed it i don't actually think i'm sorry to say i don't think i've watched that video yet i've been really backed up i have all the excuses i'm so sorry but don't you worry i'm gonna be coming back to leave comments on all your stuff That's, don't you worry get the algorithm happy can you stop crying over there um i can't believe this she just had food she went outside just a couple minutes ago i don't know why she's whining so much. oh anton okay it's 8 a.m over there hey. interesting so we're just complete opposites that's funny well yeah then i would like we could find a day that i would i would love to do it at like 9 or 10 p.m my time it would be 9 or 10 a.m your time again if you want to do it oh, three in the morning my time 3 p.m your time you know i'd make that happen Hey, I'm down, bro. Download Discord, but I honestly don't really know how to use it, but I'm a good learner. <laughs> like I said, uh, Lander was just helping me uh, earlier. I had no idea that using the emoji button could essentially verify that you are a real person in the Discord, uh, which makes sense. You just have to use the right emoji. And uh, anyway, I was like, I didn't know that. That's crazy. Me. Jason, you want to come on? Dude, I would love that. We can sing. Also, though, yeah, I want to hear. Uh, I want to hear everybody talk. You know, I would love to have every single one of y'all come make content with me. <laughs> Live streaming is fun. You can come uh, help me bug Mariah. <laughs> I've known the whole team for months, and I keep hating it. Okay, I'm gonna send you a guess, and you're gonna confirm it for me. Okay, I'll do that after this. So I don't freak out on stream and have loose lips because I I've struggled with it. <laughs> uh, Xander Stefan um, Stefan Brando, that's who we're talking about, uh, has done a large or a large portion of the visual media for Standard. Really? Okay, that's cool. I had people, I don't know, I don't remember who it was. I had someone reach out to me and say they didn't like uh, Standard's marketing. Um, I respect their opinion. But I was kind of surprised. I was like, wow, oh, I thought it was going over well. Um, I love their stuff, by the way. I can get it, it uh, you know, like a big argument being it's derivative is what I've heard a lot. I'm sorry, but like, hard not to be. <laughs> At this point, like, the media is just good for us. The content's good for Blade. Oh my goodness. This is Coda Holt, by the way. Is he... 44 subscribers? That's criminal, y'all. Hold on. That's not cool. We gotta do something about that. Hold on. Yeah, let's create a post here. Code up! <laughs> this dude is awesome. He has a whole, like, uh, skating school that he posts with. He has a lot of kids there. I was like, but will you take me? <laughs> will you teach me how to skate? <laughs> I'll join. Teach me. Lander, she wants the base thems. You, that's true. Lander, thank you for reminding me. You true. want the base thems. I do. Those are beautiful skates. I convinced myself that she wants the black uh, thems because I was like, black and they're cheap. <laughs> I do like black, so I mean. Anton, fairly new to Discord, saying, well, okay, I say that. No, I've already said the last stream and many more times before that I have used Discord for like 10 years. 
and it still confuses me. So as long as we friend each other, then we should just like I should just be able to video call you. You should you'll probably go through the regular phone permissions thing. But if you do it on your phone, you know, you could also do it on your PC. You just have to set up through the Discord settings your camera and your microphone. But anybody who wants to come on that wants to tell their story of skating, I would love to do like I'd gladly do a, a spook wackadoo Google Calendar and get y'all scheduled. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, you're smarter than me, though, Anton. Yeah, he's smarter than all of us. Rob, you don't like tripe either? High five. <laughs> it has to be made well. There's only a place, there's one place that my dad and I get menudo from, and it's called Margaritas. And that is the only place we will go to get menudo. So I definitely understand if you haven't had a good menudo yet. You may. Just give it time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true about most foods i feel though mm -hmm. you really just like you got yeah sometimes it's worth the risk if i'm paying a lot of money it's never worth the risk to me but because i love food and i want to be full by the time i eat something i like uh and i hate spending a lot of money to get a small portion of something that i probably won't like so yeah i don't always risk it but i've been getting better yeah i know you have josiah used to not eat like anything before he met me and now he will eat he ventures out a lot into his food. Do you see a trick? No. I am upset by this comment I highlighted here. What? My name's in the way. I can, not fast enough to- there it is. Well, I'm kind of glad the base thems are delayed? What happened? Why? Hmm. Why are the base thems delayed? I am puzzled. I'm sorry, I'm just catching up on this. Let me quick speed run the chat. Did Blade Trivia thing with Tree a couple years ago. I'm going to have to watch that. I love his uh, other one he did with Law and Brandon. Um, Tree's awesome. He's got to bring that back. A few of us can sing. That'd be awesome. <laughs> I wonder how that'd work with uh, latency, lag. Give us the link. Dustin, for sure. You're going to come on too, and we're going to talk about John Mayer. Xander, we're going to talk about fish brains. Name one skate that isn't derived from an older concept or design. I'll wait. Thank you. Thanks, brother. It, I like, I'm sorry, but it's just like the, we're all using old molds, right? Like I've been told that about the them. And don't, don't get me wrong. They're, they're changing. They're, they're, uh, they're improvements. So I'm not dissing Julio because the after it wasn't it Pat, Pat Ritter and Onward is now a them custom mold, if I'm correct. And then the soul plates and all that, and John Julio's fantastic. And then Mesmer with the throne, an incredible skate, and now they've they've done a great job listening to their audience, and they've upgraded the, or they've changed the toe box. Uh, I'm definitely going to be buying that skate at some point. I'm not buying that skate. I, I've already told myself I'm not going to buy that skate secondhand. Uh, I do want to buy it a full setup, but I'm going to buy that hopefully right just from them, because... From Mesmer, not from them. <laughs> from Mesmer. Um, and so, uh, so I can really support the uh, Mesmer. Man, John Julio with them. I, like, I hope that discussion was had because uh, he just knows that when people are talking in context to another company, they're going to say them. And so when I say I want to buy my Mesmers from them, and I'm talking about uh, heavy distribution... <laughs> Good stuff. Man, I love all of it. This has all been so fun. Anyway, my goodness. Um, let me replay this uh, Coda Halt thing. I had to switch to this camera because this is my Ben Enhance. Uh, I, I'll, I will scour the chat here in a second for the answer if anyone has one. Why were they delayed? I would Maybe the, probably the intuitions, I would think. I would really hope nothing on Julio's side. But that sucks, dude. Like, I'm mad for you because of the price that you paid. Like, that's not cool. I was pissed at how long I had to wait. <laughs> and it was not fair of me to be upset. I was irrationally upset about my skates uh, being like a month and a half out. And then everybody getting their skates a week earlier than me. And then I felt so rushed to finish my video because I got like, <laughs> I think... I think I counted, it was 11 or 12 messages on Instagram within two days 
hey, where's your faction video? I, I'm excited to see it. Because I think like three people had posted theirs at this point and they had the LVR. I was like, oh my God. That video could have even been better, but it's still my favorite video I've ever made. I reviewed the Ritters and Shell, and the shells were too big. I want to revisit the Schmediums at some point, enjoying factions and want to try the standards. Yeah, so I want to try the new Mesmers because it looks like they have second skins in them, and that means they'll be more true to size for my foot. Man, that's a sketchy spoon. Um, the size 10 Mesmer, the V1 Bellino that I got for $50 on Facebook Marketplace, the shell's in fine condition, it's just the sole plate is disgusting and they spray painted the thing. Um, I, all of my liners that I put in there, I could almost stick my toes out of the front of the toe, like where the, the lace up is, where the, essentially where the toe box. And it's not good, but schedule us. Yeah, I'll figure that out, that'd be fun. Um, anyway, no, and then uh, I really like the mediums on, in the thems for me. Um, I think the Schmediums are probably what Mariah needs. Schmedium. Man, that is a messy grind. Awful little <clears> run up <throat> there. This dude is thrown down. Is he flow for them? I would imagine, right? He's always skating them skates, but if he's not flow for anybody, he should be, because he's a great advertisement for them skates. Azoli. Azoli. That's good too. The traditional way google it <laughs> what are we talking about here uh rob dark who's that with 44 subs um coda halt michigander i believe um if not n like native i'm pretty sure he was at least in detroit for a while because he's friends with Naylor and weiss and all that my dinner tonight was a bag of flaming hotline oh. cheetos yes those are the best hot cheetos and Mariah delicious those, those are my childhood Hot Cheetos. Mm. Limon Hot Cheetos. Corn and broth. Yeah. Mm. The Limon. Just Hot Cheetos in general, but Limon, when we found those, we were like, oh my god. So good. This disaster is insane. Hold on. We need to, we need to turn this back for a second. Bro. What are you doing? Coda. Were you paid to do this, or are you just Coda? Okay, he's crazy. <laughs> oh man, I'm bad at this. Anton, tripe would be better if it were made out of bacon. <laughs> Something with the warehouse. I'm already lost. Richard, interviewing me would be just like 30 minutes of, I want to go back to Chicago. For Are you coming thems. back for the, uh, the thing? Oh, for the base thems. Something, something, warehouse, something, something, base them. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm mad for you. Thanks for keeping me in track. You're welcome. Anytime. <laughs> but Richard, we'll talk, we'd talk about Blender. That'd be the editing episode, brother. I'd load up. Honestly, for you, I would definitely love to have you load up your skate park project and then anything else you want to show because you can, not, you can do the screen share. Uh, you, I, you'd probably have to be the videos because like I, I know what rendering real time is like, especially when you're doing something like uh, talking to each other through Discord. But... Um, I, you could do that, and then I could pull up some of my After Effects stuff. Like, I could bring up the Faction video and just so, show some of the simple things that I've used. Um, because the biggest thing about editing is finding the right assets. Something that people don't really understand, but I don't create, like, more than 50% of the crazy 3D things that I find. Is I have a subscription to something where people create that stuff already, and then I can just repurpose it with, it, like, moving the camera, re-logoing, re-texturing, re... Stuff like that. So it still worked, don't get me wrong, but it's a lot easier now. <laughs> we could talk about stuff like that, like talk about the realities of editing. That's a good episode right there. Like, we can make it work for all of you. Dustin, I got an email and posted it. Okay, dope. I'll check that out, homie. Great guy. Episode two of Blade Trivia. All right. If I'm on, it's going to be a therapy session, bro. Those are needed. So. Whatever you want to dish out, you come to me and we talk about it. Like I, we love listening and talk, like Mariah, like not to brag, but Mariah and I have helped a lot of people. <laughs> a lot of people have come in and out of this household that have needed help. And uh, we like supporting you. So, you know, whatever you want to come on and talk about, I would love to 
I, and of course I will reciprocate. I, you won't just be standing there bearing everything. Like I, I'll reciprocate stories with you. You know, we'll talk. But that's good, dude. That needs to happen. Okay. Uh, the email said them were only delayed a month, and it's due to manufacturing. It can mean so many things. I wonder what that means. Like, is that on intuition side, or is that on them side? I would, f I would think on intuitions, but who knows? It could be like, uh. Like, and obviously not to say, oh, it's them's fault or intuition's fault immediately. I just mean, like, is it intuitions, uh, the people they're working with? Like, maybe someone's, they ran out of that pattern for the 90s thing. You know, maybe they d underestimated how many 90s pattern intuitions they needed to print. So they got to get a hold of that again. Maybe those people printed the wrong thing. Maybe they ran out of the champagne stitching. There's all sorts of, there's so many things that go into it. Especially, I just work for a car wash. And it's crazy the amount of things that slip through. I can't imagine what it's like with a custom skate like that. But yeah, definitely one of the most beautiful skates in my opinion. I absolutely love that thing. I'm a sucker for pink, but also just like the that, that liner we all understand is gorgeous. With them in standard, it keeps getting harder to talk about what you're trying to talk about. <laughs> yeah, I think that might have been the goal. Uh, I truly wonder if... That's something that, again, Law considered the same way that John Julio probably did, like, them goods. Should we just go with them since it's one, you know, it's one of the how many, uh, it's a pronoun, right? Yeah, pronoun. I should know this. Don't get mad, mom or dad. <laughs> Felt my pain. <laughs> praying he gets oh when i'm praying i got praying yeah for me praying to get my skates yeah we had no idea where they were me richard and sean we we're all like wait a minute where are these skates at hey thank you libby faction video is just so good i can't even believe how good the editing is thank you i really appreciate that editing is what i do for a living so if i weren't good at it it would be embarrassing <laughs> oh my goodness i am bad at this chat thing 909 extra small life here bro that's like that's got to be nice though at least for control wise because i've skated some big bulky skates the size 10 i think actually it might be size 10 and a half rims that i got holy cow man they are like comets freaking you come down from a grind they're burning up in the atmosphere <laughs> thanks jasmine Solid editing. Thank you. My editing is rustic charm. You know what? That's still kind of a compliment. Backhanded compliment, but I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it for you. Defend my buddies. But again, uh, not all of us are supposed to do the same thing. And I love drawing inspiration from each other. Like, Wayoko, I draw inspiration from not only all your videos. And, like, I've actually watched your videos and be like, I'm going to go try that trick and have done that. Um... I'll, I'll come up with the receipts too. I'll try to remember which one was the real one. I'll tell you. But there was a time I remember watching a video on my television. I was like, oh, that's cool. I want to try that. Um, anyway. Uh, yeah, dude, you're, you're, we're not all supposed to do the same thing. We're supposed to A, first and foremost, enjoy what we're doing. B, uh, want to share that thing with others. Understand that you are putting yourself out there, but know that there are us that care about you and the rollerblading community and are here to digest that and participate in that. And the algorithm and analytics, we were talking about this actually in Alex Alexis chat earlier during his live stream, um, Bigfoot Blader, Lander and I, uh, and I'm sure there was a few others pitching in too, I can't remember now. Um, but we were talking about how analytics can really throw you off. You're like, I... For example, um, Anton, I've, uh, I'll just bring up this. Um, I noticed that, uh, like your Mesmer, uh, Teamscape video, I think is going on 1.3 thousand video or views now, which is freaking amazing. Uh, which is a great video too. Um, and then, you know, I was looking today, um, as much time I put into the spook or my, uh, faction edit, uh, it's now peaked at 1.1. Um, not a competition, but it's one of those things when you look at that, you're like, why can't I get more people to see this? I'm so proud of this. 
So it's one of those things, honestly, it's like letting your kid out into the world. You're like, why aren't people paying attention to my child? They're so great. It's like the Will Smith meme with Jaden Smith where he's like, <laughs> everybody look at my boy. <laughs> um, I'm so I'm sorry to call you out, Anton. I'm happy, like, I hate to sound jaded, but I'm happy for all our success, you know? That's the thing. Um, and the problem is, like, my point is, it doesn't matter the amount of effort you put into something. You should do it because you love it. And I had a long time, or I, I put a lot of effort into that and it took a long time to make it and I'm very proud of it. And the people that viewed it and have talked to me about it have uh, also expressed how much they enjoyed it. And so that makes me want to make more, you know, and that's an important part of doing what you love. Um... That's so important again about blading too is it's doing it with people that you love even though this is all over the internet this is so important anyway i'm rambling hot cheetos movie on hulu is great oh, we need to watch it i, I uh, wanted to. i know mariah wants to watch it and i'm just like eh. yeah <laughs> i only like i only like intentionally really funny things and really funny is of course objective so it's always fun for everybody <laughs> you'll laugh maybe cry <laughs> I'm saying Google Pozzoli. Okay, do I have? I really got to do that. I got to do. I do I do that with everybody watching? <laughs> Pozzoli. You have to specifically Google it, and something will happen. Or can I look it up on Ecosia? Because that's my default browser, and all I see is a traditional soup or stew from Mexican cuisine. It is made from hominy with meat, can be seasoned or garnished with shredded lettuce, cabbage, uh, chili peppers, onion, garlic, radishes, avocado, salsa, limes. Known in Mesoamerica since the pre-Columbian era, today the stew is known across Mexico and, keep going please, and neighboring countries, uh, oh, well, okay, I thought it was going to say, and it's known as menudo, <laughs> but, okay, so is this what you, uh, Forgive me for already forgetting, but are you saying that you ate, th or like you eat this, you like this? Because it sounds very similar, and I'm sure Mariah would love this, and if it doesn't have tripe in it, then you know, I'm sure I'd like it more too. I've been vibing on Hot Pot, I mean, we've talked about Hot Pot a few times in Ben's chat, but if you guys have not tried Hot Pot, or like the Korean barbecue... Richard, yes, totally nerd out on editing. What'd you say, hon? I just said delicious. De absolutely, right? Yeah. We fishing. Wait a minute. Oh, that's right. I was like, why did this all change? Because <laughs> I brought over another window. Pimp my ride. Yeah. Wait a minute. Don't you stop my music. Don't you do that to me. I am playing the we fishing. Thank you. Hey, <laughs> look at that. Anyone see Lino's new video? Basilisk, Basilisk wheels make an appearance. Been meaning to ask, and I probably could have figured this out on my own, but I'm just now remembering. Uh, can I order those? I've got uh, a homie I want to gift those to. Um, I think they'd be perfect for him. And um, I'm sure I'll probably get myself some. <laughs> I talked to Ben the other day and he explained how stressful it is to keep up with chat. I used to be stressed just editing when I did YouTube. Couldn't imagine dealing with stream too. There's a lot. Yeah. And you have to make quick decisions and you have to do all of that with the camera pointing in your face. And I am far away and my face, here's the box. Here's the box on your screen. It's like a pixel. It's like a profile. It's smaller than Lino's right now. When Ben is on stream, his face is the size on of the chat box on my stream here so he is all right there you are watching him witness the things that happen in stream and uh like he has to process jokes that make no sense because like i'm already struggling with things that i've said and forgot because i'm meandering in my own conversations and brain and um anyway i'm doing it again but no you're right uh streaming is fun and I think like 
I think Ben does a really good job of it. And yeah, this it can be a lot, but I think that's just one of the things that comes with it. Um, he's got good moderators too, so yeah, it's hard for him to address everything, but um, I think he'll come to realize it's good for him just to trust that the moderators are going to do what they do. He's got a, a fleet of them, a literal fleet. <laughs> but no, man, I think that you would enjoy it, especially if you can find a way to do it with your skates on. It's not easy. Um, I want to find a way to run my camera out to my driveway when I can get back out there. Um, be able to do this and that. I can run, like, come back in and sit on the couch when I'm cooling off and, like, play something, this and that. And then when I want to go back and out and skate, kind of like Ben does. The pinnacle of streaming. <laughs> Super hard on wheels, Wayoko. All right, have you, I'm assuming you have not tried Basilisk yet? China factory side. I'm sorry, I'm not remembering what I'm what we're talking about. <laughs> okay, hold on. Blade Club. <laughs> Jasmine, did Spook say I like pink? Absolutely, pinks, I love, I love all colors. And I cycle through phases. For the past about year and a half, my favorite color has probably been about it's probably been orange last year like for, before this for it's about a year and a half cycles I'm trying to remember what it was what because i've really been vibing on orange what was like my f i had like a favorite color before this too and every year and a half it changes you liked blue and orange together a lot that's true it's cyan and orange i really love that i guess it probably was more cyan but salmon color i do like salmon color but no my uh point is, is that my favorite color changes a lot because i love them all um sometimes i just vibe with one more than the other oh <laughs> answer my question haven't bought any yet got some wheels to try first but i'm keeping them in mind absolutely <laughs> i know I, I, i'm talking about uh when i said backhanded compliment i said backhanded compliment towards yourself that's what I meant. You were knocking your when I get like I get offended for you. That's something you should know about me as a, a person. This is something that carries on throughout my whole life, especially with people that I consider my friends. Like I said, I get offended for you. I do this to Mariah a lot when she's down on herself. I was like, don't talk about my girlfriend like that. You know, like I'll say that to my buddies. You know, don't don't say that. I'll say that about my friends. You know why it's them, right? I don't. I have no clue. Why Elko got that camera quality though? Yeah, he does. I mean, he's you got a good eye for angles too. You was true about that. Thanks, Richard. <laughs> we all like and sub in the community, but we mostly share them in order in other rollerblading media. Yeah, absolutely. And then that's most important. I always try to like and comment, and I've not been doing so good on the comment part, especially because a big part of that is when I watch uh, skating. You know what that does it makes me want to skate and so that's real hard with a fractured ankle so when i see you guys skating i'm just like oh man i'm gonna put on one of my skates <laughs> just on the good foot i think the only reason my mesmer video is getting views it's because of the skates my other videos haven't gotten many views yeah don't get me wrong it's like there's definitely weight to that argument but it also you did a good job with the video which is important like the algorithm does judge that stuff um but you're absolutely right about that Yoka and i were just talking about that like my most viewed video is my wish review which is one of my worst well uh, not one of my okay i take it back it's not one of my worst but i did a pretty bad job with audio mixing in that one um and uh it's was, it was pretty basic video you know and then my them skate video, which I, I am proud of that one. I, mean, I got I am proud of all my videos, but uh, like obviously more so proud of other ones based on how good I felt while I was shooting and editing them. Some of them, you know, it was just fun to make. Some of them you get like goosebumps when you shoot and then even more so when you edit. Uh, I had that with the them review. I had that with the faction review. Um, those are the most outward standing ones. Every other video that I've shot, I've had that moment where I'm just like, oh, that felt amazing, that felt great, or that's gonna look great, or that edit's gonna come together real nice. But if you've, like, I don't know the best thing to compare it to beyond editing, but if you've ever edited something and it came together so well, specifically a video, maybe music too, and you're just like, oh my goodness, 
it just hits and you feel it feel it you know and you're ready to give it to the world and it's a bit like this that was oh and then um my battleground edit the intro of that where it starts off slowly or slowly showing a little bit of the skate park the battleground in kalamazoo here and then brian weiss comes on screen fakie and he uh fakey true five is it no wait no he comes in and he 540 uh i'm pretty sure souls switch souls maybe Damn, why don't i just bring it up it's my video I've already played this music too, so if I get stuck with it again, I'm pretty sure I won't get stuck with it, but uh, let me pull this up here. Uh, eh, eh, eh. Why, Oko, I always watch your content when you release something, Anton. Same. I always end up watching all y'alls. Sharing other non blader friends. Or with other non-blader friends so they know what you're doing it works it does work a lot of people are very interested in that you'd be surprised how many people used to blade too you know be like oh i can't believe that i've stopped doing that should go to the roller rink again <laughs> here it is battleground edit i absolutely love this video and a big part of it is because of uh the intro here in thank to uh the band Ra R A. shout out to my brother caleb for reintroducing me that uh me to that band he played it a lot for me in high school i never latched to it but uh i would say my ear for music is a lot better tuned now <laughs> google the origin of uh, i already forgot the word <laughs> this one there? the dish that he told us about it's barbaric The camera died. Um. Calling all bladers. Calling all bladers. The camera's gone dark. Do not panic. Do not panic. There they are. Um, Ben's moderators. <laughs> Happens to the best of us. I'm, yeah, I'm sure it does. Whatever I was talking about. <laughs> Slidey boy Ben. Thought I was colorblind. No, I am colorblind. It's just, but colorblind doesn't mean you don't specifically. It's like specifically you don't see color. Um, it just means that colors I I see them differently. So like purple and blue specifically when they're really close to each other are very hard for me to um to see. Uh, and then you got things like red and brown. Those like uh, when I say hard to see, they mix together. Like I can. If, even if there's a fine line between a purple and a blue, sometimes I can't see that fine line. Same with some greens and yellows, um, some uh, reds and oranges, some reds and browns. Mine is quite the span, uh, you know, and I was hired as a videographer, and I just brought that up in passing after I was hired, and they were like, what? <laughs> Why are you an editor then? I was like, I should sue you for saying that to me. <laughs> Orange and green are my favorite colors in general. Uh, Dustin, we're homies. You know that. Orange and green. Awesome vibes. Agreed. Aren't those Green Bay Packer colors? <laughs> hey, we don't talk about the Packers here. And that's green and yellow, right? Yeah. We like the... Let's go Lions. <laughs> the best team ever. When John was still doing Valo, he did them goods, right? It was named them because the verse them good shop was is based in Milpitis, which they refer to as the M. Interesting. Milpite Mil Milpitas. 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 Milpitas Milpitas. Okay, guys, I'm gonna play, play this, this in a second. second. I'll do, I'll do that, that for you right now. now. It's been, been a second. second. Why, Why did it skip? skip? Yes, please. Oh! Can you, you hear, hear me, me twice? twice? Now you can't. You're welcome. Football. I agree with you.
And in Michigan, that is uh, that is quite the uh, arbitrary and hated statement. I cannot tell you the amount of times, especially at office events where all the the dudes come together. Good, thank you. Um, where they just like crawl at the mouth over. I mean, I already forget his name, but he's like the most famous football player probably of all time now, but it is one of them. The Tom Brady. Oh, Tom Brady, Tom Brady, I love you. I wish I looked like you and could have everything you have. I love you, Tom Brady. Surprised them didn't keep the umbrella logo. Oh, I've never seen that. Oak City. Oh, yeah. Shab, we do appreciate you and your skate knowledge. And that's how, Sean, I really think that your stream is probably going to be one that needs the most prep because I want to capture as much knowledge as I can. I want you to come on with as many stories as you possibly can muster. If you're down to do a long one, you know, I did a almost seven hour stream the other day. I was just thinking about how fun it would be to do an eight hour stream and just to flex. I'm going to do it, especially now that I'm uh, like, then I'm going to be done sitting soon, but we'll see. I don't know if I have the time. <laughs> <laughs> damn you missed an opportunity to strap a pair of frames on your cast that would have been funny how probably hard to do though <laughs> yeah you're right sliding to the dms <laughs> rich from carrier shops with carrier stuff yeah that's a good point y'all helping out butter and time make it happen Umbrella logo. Holler at long. Yeah, for sure. Okay, let me put this on. Sorry, I keep procrastinating. Um, F. Hit panicking. Look at that dog. Panic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this part right here. That's right, he does come in fakey. Look at this maniac. Look at this freaking maniac. Oh my goodness, it hits so hard. I'm gonna turn it up. We're gonna get copyright struck and we're all gonna love it together. Uh, I don't know if y'all have seen this. Um, sorry if you haven't, I'm shoving it down your throat, but I like... This is why I love editing, because this stuff still comes back to me and I'm like, yes! Sorry, that was loud. Freaking maniac. Freaking maniac, bro. Do the thing. Do the thing. Oh my goodness. Hey, Sean. I've met Brian Weiss once. It was that bitter cold, and I talked to him. Sean. Who knows who knows important things i'm jealous of you how do you do the people just tell you things sean they just come up to you and they're like hey i want to give you a little i want to give you a secret you need a sweet mask sean i would love to order a bunch of more of those spook masks they're just actually i, I wonder if they even sell them anymore they're just generic like I think it was 20 bucks, which honestly isn't even that bad for a, a really custom uh, mask. <laughs> I love me some eagles. <laughs> so does uh, everyone in uh, uh, sunniest Philadelphia. Have you watched that show? <laughs> I love that show. <laughs> Go eagles! <laughs> Where are we going? We going On my back. last video, I said some things about these skates that back. some people didn't like. So... Bats Nation. Colts here. 
Football as in a sport. You think he's going to be excited? Oh, oh, yeah, for sure. Football for as sure. in a sport when you kick the ball with your foot, or are you talking moves? about you hand doing? egg yeah. ball? <laughs> Which is basically like tough rugby. No, 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 my friend. No, 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 no. You can't say yeah. that is tough rugby. That is not true. Rugby is tough American football, dude. I've watched rugby, and let me tell you, more than watched, I have heard rugby. The way those people hit each other. Don't get me wrong, I know there's crazy stuff that happens in football, and I know they get really hurt. I'm not trying to demean that at all. But rugby, bro, the stuff they do to each other with no pads and leather on, I was just like, what is wrong with you maniacs? My my friend does that, and he was just a jaguar on the on the freaking uh, field, dude. Um, oh, Ben watched this on his stream, so we've all... We've all been through it. Grindo nuts. If you guys ain't watching Grindo nuts, only 13. Oh, I'm sorry, 132 subscribers. Touch rugby. Touch. Ru oh, I'm sorry. Did I read it as? Okay. Touch rugby. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> well, I went on this whole rant because I want to defend rugby for my friend. <laughs> I appreciate you, Ed Todd. <laughs> That's. That's freaking amazing, then. Yeah, you clearly agree with me. Touch rugby. That's amazing. I'm gonna start calling it that. Indianapolis was like that. I was just walking through Walmart, and at least three strangers stopped to ask if I saw the Colts game. <laughs> Did you catch that pig skin? You catch damn dogs in that pig skin? Yeah, I... I, I don't know. Like, I, I respect all sports, because, like... What, am I going to sit here with wheels on my feet and act like people who run as hard as they do, work out as hard as they do, dedicate as much time to something that they love, aren't playing a sport or aren't uh, someone you should respect? No, I absolutely do. You know, it just comes down to when somebody's making as much money as they do, that's when I can tell what type of person I think you are. When you got that much money, you can see how they spend that pretty openly. You can see how it affects them pretty quickly. And that's when I know. And I feel like with it's just hard for... It's getting better. But it's hard for sports like that, for people not to idolize themselves because of how much they can be idolized. And that's very dangerous. Colts are a solid team. Okay, I don't know nothing about that. <laughs> but I'll take your word for it. <laughs> the Saints. Do, 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 do. They played the Colts in the Super Bowl, and the Saints won. <laughs> I'm just saying. When in 1932? It was a while ago. <laughs> I was in like middle school. <laughs> Rob, are you wet? Sean has one of those faces. You just want to tell him your secrets. Pretty sure I told him my pin at the riot. <laughs> yeah, that happens. Indianapolis. Oh, dude, you're in Indianapolis? Bro. Let's skate together. Yo, I'm gonna... We're, let's skate together sometime. I'll come out. I'll pick you up on the way out to skate with Tree. Dude, yes. Jason, hit you up next time. You're in Fort Wayne. You guys film that. And then also invite me, and if I can make it, I'll try. <laughs> you played rugby in school. One sport which South Africa dominates in. Dude, I can only imagine. Um... I know that uh, South Africa and uh, he's told me this is not me being a bad person. My friend has learned a lot about himself and his uh, origin story has changed a lot. He's not from Sierra Leone. He's from Ghana, correct? Seku? He's from Ghana and he is exceptional at rugby as well. And I believe he any has sport. family. Yeah, well, any sport. That's absolutely true. Yeah. But he he really connects with rugby. Uh He's really good at it. Like when I say, I've told this story, I think before on stream, but my man Seku, when he was, uh, sorry, by the way, I didn't give any context to this. I'm going to do this quick. Mike's GI Joe or GI Dojo. This is Mike McFly's toy channel. Go um, follow us if you haven't. He, uh, Seku on the field once, uh, chased, like someone broke away from his whole team. And they were completely clear to, I don't know, the end zone. I'm sorry to Americanize it so much if that's not the term, but that's what I know. <laughs> American football. Um, but he sees that happen. And my man's got an ankle or an, an injured ankle at this point. 
he locks in his head. He's just like, well, I got to do this. I, saw him, I, I swear I saw him shake his head like, man, I got to be the one to do this. He flies past his team that can't ke- catch up with the two that have broken away. And he, tack- or he grabs the first one by their shirt as he's like starting to dive. They uh, diagonally throw forward underhand. I'm sure I don't got to explain that to Anton, but the, um, he does that like right as he gets grabbed to the person in front of him. Seiko uses the momentum of pulling in that person he just grabbed as the ball leave that per- leaves that person's hands and the other person uh, wasn't that far away. He's just about to grab it. He grabs that person too with the momentum and pulls them both in kind of like cross-armed and spins like a freaking hurricane. He, he did a true top tackle. It was freaking amazing, man. Uh, no, that's... Like, I tell that story a lot. I tell a lot of stories about Seku because I love him. I want to have him on here at some point. You guys will love him too. But, uh, uh, man, that that stuff is... Oh, man. You yeah, know, rugby's crazy. You cannot disrespect rugby or anybody that wants to put in the time into doing a sport like that. There, uh, There's somebody you don't mess with. And I would say that about my friend Seku and everybody that I met when I was... I went to Nashville with him for a rugby tournament and... I should put that together that footage and give it to him and uh, maybe I could share that on stream when he comes on but got I am Danny I subscribe to every single person that has rollerblading on their channel so truly I don't know I do not remember who this person is so what? 117 that's pertinent we got 9 minutes until we're uh, ODST is dropping into gear talk by the way I'll give context to that too I guess when, before we go John 117 Master Chief reporting for duty I want this suit so bad I would pay so much money to have this suit Also we're just kind of listening to the person's music I'm sorry that's not cool <laughs> I didn't share the other video from last time because I'm a stinker, so let me share this here. <laughs> Rob, yeah, so we got ramping camp. You should, homie. If uh, um, you can only come for a day, you definitely should. Um, I'm hoping that Tim is going to post about the fall one, but it's getting pretty close to fall. So I don't know. I uh, Who knows? Um probably got some ambitious goals for uh, the rail garden that he wanted to make but uh anyway watching mike's collectibles <laughs> yeah the expensive stuff willard skate park dope all right well i would love for you to do a skate park tour with me i want to do more skate park tours where essentially i just uh skate everything in it <laughs> that's my favorite thing about skating is trying new things so i really want to force myself to try everything in a park try the line referring to end zone okay i heard that multiple times while i was there so help you thank you for helping me make that connection that ties a lot together for me rs travel your blade travel agent would like to inform you that amtrak services indianapolis via the cardinal which runs from chicago to new york city Thank you for your continued business. How is your experience, dude? I, like, I, Mariah does not like trains. She has a very rational fear of trains. They are the big honking machines. Um, wow. But I, yeah, I would gladly take a train if we, especially, dude, if we were all just to hop on and, like, I would bring my monitor. Like, uh, when I say monitor, a camera monitor, like one of those seven-inch portable ones that has camera batteries. We would shoot. We would review on the train. We could, uh, like, especially if we did it together and we could pre-plan enough, get one of those carts where we have electricity so we could plug stuff in. And we could, like, stop and get shot. Like, how fun would it be to do... Everybody's done an RV tour. Some people do, like, van tours. Some people, you know, car tours. Or I'm going to bike across America. Let's just take a train, bro. Let's just train across America and skate it. We got uh, eight... Or we got five minutes... Until we are to uh, back to blading, so let me promote my man Tree Tree. Um, Tree Tree's got big things on the horizon, especially with his new frame coming out. Um, 
I know he's talked about we can expect more of this stuff. Is it? It's just not loading. Okay, it was just lagging. Uh, if you guys have prime frames, uh, A, send me your cores, please. Second, um, don't listen to me and keep your cores and buy the undersold tree tree frames. Do yourself a favor. If you've tried able frames, you understand. But these are like the able frame H block and that they are pyramids. And holy pazoli. It's amazing. Originated with the Aztecs and other indigenous tribes in Mesoamerica. Oh. Mm -hmm. So it, uh, pazoli comes from, uh, cannibalism that's dope that's freaking dope bro somebody tell uh arlo he can make a campaign about pazoli <laughs> yeah. oh <laughs> that's awesome mars thanks for looking that up i was very curious why well, i like having you here you're my wing woman <laughs> You can do Amcra Amtrak cross country. Yeah, so Jasmine, my family actually has an amazing story about that. Uh, and uh, I'm sure both my parents will be able to talk about it. I want to have them on individually at some point and then probably uh, together. Just as this goes, I'll be doing many streams. But especially if I get that Google Calendar. I'll be like, you guys, we're going to slot in the calendar. I'm going to set like have email reminders sent out. But uh, anyway, as we were talking, Tree Tree's frame, the Diamond Age block, feels so freaking good, man. Oh, you just got done with work, dude. Nah. I'm sorry, homie. I hope you get uh, a proper chance to unwind. You deserve it. Working hard. Yeah, Wayoko, man, you too, homie. Does the work you do mad respect? Are you... You told me when we uh, talked to Bitter Call. I'm not sure. I think you've talked about uh, your analytics a little bit in your videos, if I remember correctly. But, like, sounds like you do some intense work, man. And I have mad respect for that. 12 hours in coach was long enough. I would look at a sleeper. Oh, yeah. But the ride was fine. It's smoother than most flights. Well, yeah, for sure. Yeah, so um, again, I've uh, I I didn't elaborate at all. I've been on a train um for or cross country before. We got comped a sleeper car because of our experience, and uh, I'll let my parents tell that story better than I'll be able to because I was, I think I was eleven. What 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 was I? Nine ten. Mom, dad, if you're still around. But uh, uh I loved sleep falling asleep on that train. I think it was a core memory for me. I don't even know if I really fell asleep rather than just kind of was, was relaxing on the top bunk of the sleeper car that we got comp, but man, that was fun. And uh, now I just love being in cars and I could fall asleep. But uh, it's really easy for me to fall asleep in cars is what I mean. Let's get on there, please. Sean, a little over 12 hours. I'm starving, bro. Yeah, I'm about to drive home and get yelled at by my dogs. <laughs> <laughs> dogs are friggin' cute. Yo, I told my, uh, Sean, I told my brother, by the way, thinking of your dogs, reminds me of Ramping Camp, um, told my brother Caleb, uh, who's a culinary artist, truly, uh, that you had your pizza oven, because he's like, I want to come to Ramping Camp, and I'd love to bring the smoker and make some stuff for people, because he's a very generous dude, and he has a big heart, and he shares that with food, um, because he's, again, so anyway, he's so freaking good at making food. But I told him that he was like, uh, "What? That's amazing. He wants to meet you." <laughs> so I'm hoping I can get him out to ramping camp. But again, that comes down to ramping camp being scheduled. Um, and I'm gonna, if I can, I'm gonna try to bring like four or five pieces of plywood so I can set up a uh, freaking hawk trackler and happy tooths uh, setup that they had going so I can just practice some grinds because man, I was itching for grinds when I was at ramping camp. And I know he's working on that rail garden, but that's my biggest critique still for ramping camp is it's just not inviting to newcomers to go out there and watch the level of skating that you're watching for potentially the whole five, maybe even six days. You want to skate. So, yeah, I uh, I was really struggling with that because I had to learn to drop in and the, those massive ramps are the biggest ramps I've ever dropped in on. Um, I had to learn how to do that. Uh, for the first two days, and then I could, I felt like I could start skating. Uh. 
All right. Oh, 20 seconds. Oh, man, this is starting soon. All right, y'all. Well, uh, I'm going to throw this into the chat. Go and support the man. Uh, we all love him and what Standard's going to be doing. We know it's going to be crazy awesome. Tell him, let's co uh, collaborate, says Sean. Dude, I like... There's the... Uh, Hold up the stream on another thing too. There's the uh, Shredpool faction. It's gonna be the Spook Wackadoo standard, maybe. <laughs> anyway, come skate Fort Wayne with me sometime. Even bigger ramps. I will, homie. All right, you know what to do. Go drop a, a 117. Uh, ODST dropping in. Wait. Uh, whatever. Spartan one one seven reporting. <laughs> Pin. <laughs> oh, dude, Sean. Absolutely. I'm gonna work on getting on bigger rails today. Or today. I'm gonna work on getting bigger rails when I'm back and uh, getting on that beautiful garden rail. Barbecue pizza. Yeah, bro, that's what that was. You hold it down, Travis. No, we're just moving over to uh, uh, uh the the spook dirt, spook tar, spook tar is what that sounds like. Spook dard, <laughs> the spook dard skate team. <laughs> Sean, I'm gonna message you after this, and uh, you you can't you like I get it if you can't tell me, but just don't respond if I am right, you know, because then you can have deniability, and Law's not gonna watch his stream. Because I'm streaming during him. So, anyway. Appreciate y'all opening the other screen. Yeah, make it happen. We got uh, the father, the father-in-law. I guess you can just call him father-in-law of blading, you know? Just make it happen. All right. Well, I am... No. Well, I appreciate opening another stream. <laughs> but I want to move over and listen. I want to see what he's got to say. And I've been going live uh, for... What is it? Hour and a half. Mariah's been sitting here dealing with me long enough, so. Yeah. Oh, drop a deuce. Tell him Spook sent ya. Spooky dookie. Spooky dookie. That's gonna be merch, bro. Spooky deuce. Spooky dookie. I love that so much. Sorry, I'm listening to him at the same time. I'm trying to keep it together. Yeah, go drop a spooky deuce. Love y'all. Later, bladers. Catch y'all on a flippity flip. <laughs>